At around 11 p.m. on a Friday night in October 1999, Nicholas White left his office on the 43rd floor of the McGraw Hill building in New York, where he worked as a production manager for Business Week, and went for a cigarette break. When he finished his cigarette, he returned to the lobby and got into an elevator, pressing the button marked 43. The express elevator rapidly ascended as it usually did. However, after just a few seconds, it jolted to a halt, the lights flashed and the elevator stopped. Nick waited a moment, expecting a voice to offer information or instructions on how to get the elevator going again, but none came. He managed to pry open the doors, only to be faced with a brick wall. He called for help, but no one heard him. He used the open door to urinate, in the hopes that someone would notice, but no one did, and all the while the alarm rang continuously. After 41 hours, Nick was finally rescued, 